Hello everyone and welcome to this video series on financial statement analysis. Financial statement analysis also called ratio analysis is the most important tool in the toolkit of financial analyst. So anyone who is working in the field of core finance such as investment banking, equity research, credit research, corporate finance, private equity, venture capital, credit rating or other related finance profiles then you definitely need high level knowledge of financial statement analysis. So far we only understood the financial statements like income statement, balance sheet, cash flow, statement of sale equity, other comprehensive income statement. We have understood them. We have also understood them the format, they, all the items of these financial statements and we understood how these financial statements are connected with each other. But that is definitely not sufficient to make any or meaningful interpretation out of the financial statements if you want to look at the profitability, liquidity, solvency of the company or business. So let me repeat it. If you want to make meaningful interpretation uh, of the company, of the business, then merely looking at the financial statements, you want to be able to understand anything how much liquid, how much profitable, how much solvent the company is, how efficiently the company is utilizing its resources. We want to be able to make much interpretation out of the financial statements only. We need to analyze them. And the process of analyzing the financial statement is called financial statement analysis. So, Let's uh, do a quick review of financial statement analysis. What do we mean by that? So financial statement analysis is the process to determine the strength and weakness of company on the basis of financial statements. So there are five financial statements which I have already told you in the video series. The first statement is income statement, then balance sheet, cash flow statement, statement of sale equity. We have one another statement called other comprehensive income or loss statement. In our financial statement analysis, we generally focus on these three statements, income, balance and cash flow. Okay, 95% of the time, ratios will be calculated based on these financial statements. Now the question arises, which I tried to answer you just in this video at the start. Why do we need financial statement analysis when we already have the financial statements with us? So here is the answer. The financial data which is given in financial statement is actually very complex and it is absolute data and it will not reveal much or it will reveal almost nothing about the strength and weakness of the business. You want to be able to make meaningful interpretation of the company's liquidity, its profitability, its activity, its solvency business risk, financial risk, growth prospects and the trends. Financial statement analysis which we are going to understand in this video series that will actually make the complex data into simple and understandable format which will make comparison between various groups to draw various conclusion on various parameters such as liquidity, profitability, activity, solvency business risk, financial risk and other company trends. So the data which is complex in financial statement you can make it understandable with the help of financial statement analysis. It will help you to gain insights in various aspects of companies which I have already talked about like its liquidity, profitability, activity, solvency, business risk, financial risk and other company trends. It helps to understand how good or bad the company is over a period of time. You can make comparison between your company and competitors with the help of financial statement analysis. To some extent, you can also foresee how your company may do in future on various aspects such as liquidity, profitability, solvency, valuations, businesses, financial risk, growth prospects and company trends. So now you understand that financial statements are definitely important, but they do not reveal much 
about the strength and weakness of the company so you need to do analyze them and that analysis process is called financial statement analysis so in this video series we are going to cover this most important tool of the financial analyst this is a very high level or highly demanded skill when you want to face the interview in the core finance profiles so fasten your seat belt and now in the next video onwards we will cover financial statements or ratios in very detail thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video